Places across central Georgia are seeing the economic impact from the National Bikers Roundup at the Georgia National Fairgrounds in Perry. Brianna Richardson stopped by some hotels and a restaurant and joins us live with what they're calling a big boom of business. Yeah, here at Abbott Hotel in Perry, right off of Sam Nunn Boulevard, I spoke with General Manager, Manager Anita Patel, and she tells me that there are about 80 rooms here, but at least 60 are reserved for bikers here for the Roundup. The Roundup was supposed to happen in Perry last year, but was canceled because of the pandemic. So event organizers tell me they expect this year to be one of the largest yet, with about 40,000 people coming in from all 50 states. Patel says Avid Hotel has been booked for Roundup Week since 2020. It's the bikers, uh, they have been booking since last year, August. So we were fully booked since last year, August for this whole week. Yes, and it's been, yeah, I'm, I'm excited to see them. And right up the street from the hotel, there's Red Lobster. Manager Matthew Newkirk says they get a big boom during dinner hours. Um, we've seen in the last two nights that the bikers usually come in at nighttime. Um, they've been here roughly about an hour before we close, so yeah. He says they're in the ideal location. Um, when we have stuff going on at the Egg Center, People come out and they shop. They they like to go out to eat. Um, the hotels are booked up. The restaurants are busy. Uh, so yes, definitely. We checked online and it appears hotels across Central Georgia are full. The closest vacancy is at least 45 minutes away. True by Hilton and Macon just opened last month. General Manager Jamila Stewart says they have at least 75 bikers with rooms. Um, they started arriving into town yesterday. And so it's been really fun to have a full uh, hotel. And I asked all three business owners if they had any worry about the spread of COVID-19. They all say they're doing their part to keep everyone safe. Stewart says safety comes first. We ask that anyone that is not fully vaccinated is wearing a mask uh, when they're in the public areas. Uh, we are really good about uh, wiping down all public surfaces um, with Lysol and other cleaning supplies. Uh, we have a few other things in place according to Hilton standards that we're doing to um, ensure the safety of our employees and our guests. And all of the managers say they do look forward to more big events coming to the area. Live in Perry, Brianna Richardson, 13 WMAZ News. Thank you, Brianna. The business managers and event goers we spoke to tell us they want to be cautious to avoid the spread of COVID-19. Most of the Roundup events are outdoors, but for the indoor ones, masks are required.